I'm Dan Stedman, and it is bittersweet that I'm leaving St. Louis after 10 years of storytelling, after making 13 feature films and so many shorts and documentaries and sitcoms, after teaching acting class for seven years to hundreds of creative Midwesterners, and of course the feature films featured over 1,300 people in the Midwest as background actors in all these projects. We started off in 2013 coming out of a swamp in Belleville in the torrential rain in late October. <laughs> we made a Christmas movie that played on TV in Europe and is now watched worldwide on Amazon. We filmed in smaller towns like Cape Girardeau, Arnold, Festus, Peevely, and we made a romantic comedy way out in Centralia, Illinois. A movie co-starring Cardinals pitcher Adam Wainwright. Hi! <laughs> Along the way there were so many fun and exciting red carpet premieres. We filmed underground with children and adults in a mine in Crystal City, Missouri. We shot in eight degree weather on Lake Michigan in the snow and also inside of a large wooden shoe. We traveled back in time with Hitchcock style mysteries of the 1950s. We played on the beach in the 1960s. We filmed a panic attack in the 1970s on an alpaca farm in Illinois. We made a whole movie about a tacky 1980s game show and the friendships that motivated those contestants. Whether it was in a 1970s shaggin' wagon or driving down the I-44 on a dark Christmas night, a heartfelt conversation in the 1980s in the car, or You've only got one sister. Or a futuristic three-wheeled Dymaxion vehicle from the future riding on a passenger train in the 1950s. We always wanted our stories to have forward momentum. Moving forward, we tried to tell stories that matter about underrepresented characters that you don't normally see on the big screen. Minorities, LGBTQ characters, women, folks over the age of 40. I look forward to our last weekend together with the premiere of The New Female Pastor at MX Movies and Bar on July 29, followed by a goodbye party. And then the next day we'll screen Eliza, our movie about a real woman in the 1850s who was enslaved by the Campbell family, the richest family in St. Louis. That movie will debut at the St. Louis Filmmaker Showcase at the High Point Theater on July 30. I wrote and directed it with Delisa Richardson, who is a mentee in my writing program and was in my acting program for years. And so I am so excited to see what she and all my creative St. Louis friends are gonna to continue to do and the stories they're gonna to continue to tell about this great part of the country.